Hi, my name is Val, or Hi. Valentine, and you can find me at Kalamiva on all the social media platforms. And my job is to entertain you, so please let me know if I'm doing my job correctly, yes? Hmm? Nirudia, Y254 on Facebook, at Y254 channel, on Twitter, hashtag is Y in the morning. So allow me, since it's Man Crush Monday, to crash on, crash, crush on three, three guys. Three, one, two, three. Now, their names are hard, so please forgive me if I make a mistake. But um, one is Eric Abumeyang. Uh, Ab Ab I don't know why you're so handsome with such a long, hard name. Alafu, thank you. <laughs> and then we have uh, Mane, and then we have Mosala. So these three guys won the golden boot. Eh, congratulations. Job well done on the Premier League. So we have here the handsome uh, 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 Bomeyang. Eh, hey! yes, that one. There he is with his shoe, and there's Mane with his shoe golden boot and then uh, yes Sadio Mane Mosala I like him he's so nice not that we're friends or anything but anything can happen and he, they could be watching Y254 so let us just appreciate you good job guys well done all right I'm done now now we can say hello hi guys hi, hi. as you can see I like football I'm a little obsessed Clearly. yeah just a bit just a bit which can you support <clears throat> Uh, it pains me to say this. My new score number six. Oh. It's Tosh, eh? We had 66 points and then we're number six. So, side tonight was 66. Six, 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 yeah, of course. Number, number of the devil. Six, 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 Georgia. Okay, thank you. You're okay? Yeah, I'm Isab Chiriot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is me. What do you do? Um, I'm a student, mm -hmm. law student, African Azalim University. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're about to drop some torts on us anytime? Oh, actually, yeah, sure. Yeah? yeah. What are your social media handles? Oh, uh, Facebook, mm -hmm. Council Asab Chiriot. Mm -hmm. uh, Twitter. Mm -hmm. Council Asab Sian Chariot and also in Instagram it's a place the same. Okay. Yeah. I, I like to finish with the queens because you're special. You're the only one here. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm good. You look like you're about to give us a run for our money. Uh, no, I'm just... gonna I'm gonna take it easy today. I'm <laughs> yeah, gonna take sure? it easy. Very easy. Mm -hmm. It's not gonna be like last time. Oh okay. Yeah. What do they call you out here in the street? My name's uh, John Karaoke. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and what I'm a student mm -hmm. at the UN. Hey, you're a cool kid. The ones who come from your say the University of Nairobi. <laughs> All right. What can I say? What do you study? Uh, I'm doing uh, mass communication. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you enjoy it? Very much. You want to do what we do here? I'm going to come and take your job. No, okay. First of all, we can shine together. Uh, yeah. Cool. It's okay. Cool. All right. Yeah. High five on it. Social media handles? Uh, Karuizu Kimani. Mm -hmm. uh, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Mm -hmm. Karuizu Kimani. Cool. You look uh, fabulous. Thank you. Mm. What is your name? My name is um, Chilang at Faith. Mm -hmm. I am a law student mm -hmm. at African Nazarene University. That's why he's scared. Eh? Very he's scared. Seen you <laughs> class yeah, at your her. best. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I am a feminist. Mm -hmm. I am a professional mediator. Mm -hmm. And I am here. Wow. Yeah. So next time, just before the handshake, we should be calling you. Please do. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So guys, since it was Mother's Day yesterday, we are kind of bringing the party on to Monday and talking about guys and their moms. How much do you love your mom? I, uh, I love my mom. Mm -hmm. I love my mom so much. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, uh, we uh, spent the whole day together. Mm -hmm. I made our breakfast in bed. Mm -hmm. There's one thing that I'm sure I did, mm -hmm. and now uh, she's you been with me. No, 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 no. Okay. It was like really special, mm -hmm. like nice toast, toast, mm -hmm. toast my eye, mm -hmm. and then there was some passion juice over there. Where, where? So yeah, sausages. Sh should we conclude that he's romantic? No. I, I would excuse, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> that no, no, no. Why? Why? Yeah, yeah. Why? But, uh, why do we have to take the standard test of showing your mother love to being a romantic lover? Because mm -hmm. because it's a it's a psychological test that's been proven Are time and sure? time again. Yeah, you you can tell how you're gonna be treated by a guy depending on how he treats the mother. I thought you mother. just said you took her food. That's nothing to do with psychology. Well, it's physical. Surely the 
it's a thought account so najua there's no way that i can repair there's absolutely no way it's a thought it's but a beautiful gesture these, these these guys out here could be treating their mothers like queens and not doing the same to these girls so is it a choice ama mnajiambia to the one day ndapenda mstana ndam treativi do you uh, practice what you preach we do practice what we preach mm-hmm. but unajua depend pia na vile mstana pia na kujanga saa zingine Oh. Eh, hey, na depend. Kukuja ni haraka ama polepole. Eh, hey, kuna saa zingine mna kujanga haraka sana. Oi, oi, oi. Yeah, too fast and uh, you cannot also we cannot always reciprocate what you're not getting. Aha. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's tedious. Yeah. Huh. How much do you love your mother? Oh. Okay, thank you for the question. Mm-hmm. Absolutely like 100% I love my mother so much. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is this the kind of love that unampenda tu akiwa reserve? I'm in Nairobi too. I'm you actually go ahead and communicate you call the house your day ma. Unajumekula vitu kama hizo. Is that the kind of relationship you have? Okay. Um to some extent, yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I do call her like mm-hmm. uh, uh but okay, is that we we not in the same place like she's in Nakuru. Mm-hmm. I'm here at school, but when I go home, I make sure I spend much of the time with her mm-hmm. like most of my time like just being with her in the kitchen mm-hmm. like talking with her like I love, I love uh, being with her mm-hmm. like yeah that's all so it's it's true what they say that mothers have a bond with their son of course is, a is monumental it? bond wow can you see um let me let me let me take you back to like um one of the greatest ballads ever made by uh, Tupac you know uh-huh. he sang about his mama uh-huh. you see it's uh-huh. not about shiko wa komto na masjui wa wapi kwingine it's about the mom <laughs> so there is no way that uh, uh, you can expect us not to have like that exceptional bond and you know old and also to also, also another point to consider is uh, the roles of our fathers in our lives mm-hmm. and that's why our relationships with our moms are that great are they absent the fathers not absent but unajua kama mzazi obviously kama mzee alikuwa anakujanga for the first thing remote iko wapi of course of course you doing something else mm. and our mothers are, are, are contrary to that kind of um that kind of uh, a pattern of parent mm-hmm. and that's why the bonds are mm-hmm. like this mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah so uh, i don't think this conversation is what you expected it to be because we have a video ready for you and i think it's important we check it out woman married her own son yesterday. The woman and her son claimed to be in love with each other and they decided to take their relationship to the next level and get married considering that the mother, Betty Mbrico, from Munitsai in Masvingo, is now six months pregnant and expecting her son's child, and her grandchild. Mbrico, 40, has been a widow for the past 12 years and has been living with her 23 years old son Ferry Mbrico. She confirmed that she is six months pregnant and that she has decided it is better to marry her son because she does not want to marry her late husband's young brothers, whom she says are coveting her. Betty stunned the village court last week when she said the affair with her son had begun three years earlier. She said after spending a lot of money sending Ferry to school following the death of her husband, she felt she had a right to his money and no other woman was entitled to it. Look, I struggled alone to send my son to school and no one helped me. Now you see that my son is working and you accuse me of doing something wrong. Let me enjoy the products of my sweat, she told the village court council. Ferret said he was more than prepared to marry his mother and would pay off the lobola balance his father had left unpaid to his grandparents. I know my father died before he finished paying the bride price and I am prepared to pay it off, he said. It is better to publicize what is happening because people should know that I am the one who made my mother pregnant. Otherwise they will accuse her of promiscuity. But local headman Nathan Mupuderwa says, we cannot allow this to happen in our village. Mashurite I will AIA, this is a bad omen indeed. In the past they would have to be killed but today we cannot do it because we are afraid of the police. He warned them to immediately break off their marriage or leave his village. They chose the latter and have since left the village. 
I told you it wasn't what you were expecting. I told you, I told you now. What's fair for Facebook at what for channel to the hashtag is why in the morning. So we started with the question, how much do you love your mom? And apparently there's somebody out there who really, really loves his mom. Your thoughts? They're traumatized. Talk to me, mom. Uh, I was <laughs> waiting for this opportunity. <laughs> you know, from the first point, he said uh -huh. that uh, it is all about romantic loving. But I totally disagree. Mm -hmm. Now, let's see what romantic loving has done to these boys. Mm -hmm. Why do you have to, to live with your mom to the age of 26 and above where mm -hmm. you can actually get a woman and marry? Mm -hmm. Then end up marrying your own mother mm -hmm. this is a totally forbidden thing in africa mm -hmm. yeah and she's pregnant and she's pregnant mm -hmm. imagine With now i just want to imagine how the kid will look like that's not nice i'm sorry at white five on facebook at white five channel twitter tell me about oh man that's a really painful uh, picture to look at mm -hmm. even to just imagine mm -hmm. you can't but i can hypothesize that i can my my thinking my mm -hmm. thinking toward it is Maybe it's maybe the dating scene over there is just too tough. You know, you might never know. Maybe it's like really difficult. There's, you can't excuse the behavior, but hey, you know, we need like some background information as to why this man, after suckling for two more years, for for two years when he was young, mm -hmm. he wants to keep up that behavior while he's a full-grown adult with 32 teeth. Seriously, I don't think we can justify that act. We just need to say it outside and mm. public wise and say that it is forbidden mm. let's not act like we should listen to the background story of it nobody has motivation to marry their own mother no one i wouldn't be motiv motivated to be married by my own father why what do you think sir well uh it's damn shocking um uh, even us uh, almost lacking some words to express this mm. okay uh in our society like where i come from we cannot even like imagine this and i believe so to many african societies you know mm -hmm. and even uh in the bible this like uh, this are uh, bullshit like it, it's never happened it mm -hmm. has never happened so like what i can see from it mm -hmm. is like even we cannot blame only the man mm -hmm. uh considering the fact that here is the mom mm -hmm. the mom also wronged mm -hmm. so the mom uh despite the fact that uh, when you were born coming to the earth like the first thing you touched mm. is like you touch your mom mm -hmm. and like your mom is the one to like lead you guide you give you some moral values issues like you should not be the one misleading you I so like guide mbaka, hmm? yes Akona guide us. okay the argument in the video was that she cannot know she's been working hard to pay off her, her her son to go study all these things keep him like proper fed and everything so she's cannot she cannot contemplate another woman so that yeah yeah if, if I can ask, is that like the mom, mom, or the step mom? Biological. Oh, oh. Biological. It could have been the step mom, it could have been like a different situation, but uh, yeah, see. that's just inexcusable. <laughs> it's, an, it's a little bit strange. It's, it's weird. It, uh -huh. it, it's like Rick and Morty kind of stuff. Like. You're definitely a cool kid. So there's this um, complex called the Oedipus complex, mm -hmm. and we're going to touch on it in a little bit. But before we do that, yeah. I want to ask you another question. So we've already, we started with how much do you love your mom, like quantity. So can I ask you how much do you love your dad? Is I it, is love it? my dad uh -huh. very much. Yeah? Yeah. Like you're, you're open with him, you can talk He's to him. He's my about best friend. Him. Oh, that's mm. so sweet. Do you, there's the opposite of Oedipus complex Electra is the Electra, complex. Yeah. yeah. Do, do you think there's a danger of Electra complex coming through? I actually think it's how the society raises you, you mm -hmm. know. If the society raises you knowing that this is a father whom you should love and respect as a father, mm -hmm. then that's it. And this is a mother mm -hmm. whom you should love, respect as a mother. Mm -hmm. So there's no need to get these terms confusing like I love my dad in such a way that I can actually get married to him. Why mm -hmm. on earth? Mm -hmm. No. It's, you know, let the society draw the line between a husband, mm -hmm. love, and the kind of love you show to your father or your mother. I like that. Yeah. We're in agreement. We are, we are together there. We should be. Yeah, we, yeah, we are. But uh, <laughs> you want to butt me, don't you? But before you butt me, now, how does your relationship with your mother affect the relationship with your significant other? Well, like, other uh, ones are too na uki 
kutafuta katoto hivi does she have to have the qualities that your mom has and not physical ati anakukumbusha mama yako venaka like is she going to be if your mom is extra loving kama anakupatia ngama hugs squishy squishy hugs is that something that you're going to look for in a girlfriend because you have gotten such love and reception from your mom of course that's always going to be in my mind mm -hmm. I uh, I'm I'm used to a certain kind of um a loving a certain kind of pattern mm -hmm. and uh, if I don't really um see it in you maybe I'm a train throw hints at you mm -hmm. like this is what I'd like I'm this is what I wouldn't like see the dangers of that ni sasa unakuja kwake unamwambia why can't you be more like my mom then I shall be what happens because what is the problem why should hmm? I be like she, your mom she is like um mm -hmm. she has set the bar Mm -hmm. uh, I've been with her for 20 plus years, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, it's 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 difficult when uh, someone else comes with their own total um, with their own total way mm -hmm. uh, or different way of um, of reciprocating um, love. Mm -hmm. you know? So yeah. Can I just say something? Say it. This is mother showing love to a son, and your mother shows love to her husband. Find your own wife who can show you <laughs> love the way you want. <laughs> Stop it's, setting it's, standards. It's a bit difficult, you know, because a mother's love is, as I hear, because I'm not a mother, it's unconditional, you know. What a kupenda, whether ufanya nini, useme nini, wapi, oh, when they ask you how many years. Uh, we don't, I don't think we have the same kind of love. Why is it supposed to be different yet? Uh -huh. When you're marrying each other, it's till death to us, but through sickness and through health. Mm -hmm. So what's so different there? Mm -hmm. What's so different? Because mm -hmm. the interpretation with... The, the interpretation that you're having of, of, of the mom is the same ones we are going to take at the altar. Are you agreeing with your Yeah, okay. Gentleman? I want to concur with my brother here. Mm -hmm. uh, like, for real, uh, us, okay, I can talk of us men. Mm -hmm. We do like our, our mothers. Mm -hmm. uh, we like that love, uh, that compassion that they are showing us. Um, even when we, we do our wrong. Like, oh, okay, so yeah. wait, I've just, so, just had an epiphany. Mm -hmm. So is this why men just randomly cheat exactly. and expect the woman just to yeah. cheat? Oh, okay. Because That's you think point. we're your mothers, eh? Yeah, and like uh, our father sometimes, like, you know, there's oh. that demarcated line uh -huh. when you do a wrong, like, you don't talk, like, uh -huh. just, uh, you can go up, punish you, like, or what. Mm. So then, uh, when we see our mothers, okay, mm. the way they're acting, uh, and the way they love us, and also the values they have. Like when they show that love to our daddies, mm -hmm. uh, we would like, like, you see, like, this are real, like, a real uh, love or relationship. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, the first thing uh, you know after growing up, mm -hmm. you know, like, when you go to school, you have been to like a family, mm -hmm. then you're like, oh, a family, love, yes. It's like between my mom and my dad. Mm -hmm. Okay, you see those values and how they work it mm -hmm. out. The, so then, uh, when you want to marry, mm -hmm. like get your uh, your chick, like then you like to have uh, to see the kind of uh, relationship your mom mm -hmm. has to your daddy. Mm -hmm. So like, it's sometimes it cannot favor the lady side, but they have to accept this this is opening my eyes yo so what happens if your dad was absent or if your dad was abusive or if your dad was not the kind of figure that you should be looking up to to be to, you know to someone else does that mean you're going to treat your your woman your woman or your wife or your girlfriend the same way that you see your mom like hey it's so deep so <coughs> like ah huh? for real Mm -hmm. So if your mom is loved, then in turn you will love your of wife. Course. So if she's abused, in turn you will abuse. That's what we're saying. That, no, no, no. That correlation doesn't really, doesn't really stick. But how will you That's learn how to treat a woman if you don't know how your mother is supposed to be treated? Well, first of all, it just comes from comes from you, you know. You wapi. Already yeah. you, you, from, you're from here complaining idea. we from can't understand women do it from Venus from dreamers. Uh-huh. It comes from inside. Whether, <laughs> whether, whether you are loving your mom, mm -hmm. Ama whether she was uh, she wasn't treated so well by the dad, mm -hmm. it doesn't really change uh, how you're supposed to treat your wife. Mm -hmm. But in in, in but what do you have to look to? Like monkey see, monkey do. Okay, uh, let me answer that. Mm -hmm. We were talking here of uh, seeing your mommy mm -hmm. uh, and like taking what all your dad is doing mm -hmm. to her, mm -hmm. but seeing the love the mommy has to 
to the daddy mm-hmm. to the husband mm-hmm. you see so then um uh, you know okay to me i know that woman or mm-hmm. or mom loves that more mm-hmm. more than the way lo- daddy loves her so in and turn so you we want to girlfriend. yeah we expect that wow. because for the relationship to wow. proceed yes. wow wow yeah. yeah. let me it just say something should be on top the hey. lady said this is loves. just TV. Yeah. typical and it's a nice put this is that is not working uh-huh. but it's yeah. reality it is reality but i want to believe you're living in your own head if wow. that's what you expect <laughs> wow honestly because i don't see why uh-huh. i should set a standard of the way my dad treats my treats my mom is the way i expect someone else to treat me mm-hmm. No that that's that was in 90s when they got married and whatever they decided that's their own mm-hmm. whatever we are deciding in the 21st century should be just different mm-hmm. they should their relationship should actually inspire you mm-hmm. not set a standard of how you should actually act in your own marriage mm-hmm. i don't think so what i can say about that uh-huh. uh, her vulnerability in mm-hmm. that situation will make you will make you aware or will make you more compassionate mm-hmm. towards your wife mm-hmm. the vulnerability that your mother suffered mm-hmm. or any other female um uh, female in your in your life mm-hmm. it will it will it will spur you on mm-hmm. to ensure that any other person who comes in your life mm-hmm. will not face or feel the same way mm-hmm. so that's gonna that's gonna act on your psychology as well that's But what i'd the, say the, the kind of way he put it is is a bit i feel those are very high expectations so if you've seen your mom being very like i want to say submissive very soft up like a penny kuongea like you can kasirisha na jiondoa to like she's never raised her voice or anything and then you find valentine who expresses herself you know as as wish the way i wish to so now you're going to give me pleasure to be more like your mom yeah? let me just that's let me just key. support you 100% you like, know what that's a nightmare like, what yeah. what we what we feminists say uh-huh. is a weak man will never know how to handle a very strong woman like you or myself mm-hmm. whatever when we try to speak okay. out they think mm-hmm. they think we're trying to project attitude on them mm-hmm. but that's not the point we're just speaking out our minds mm-hmm. that this is not the way i want things to happen mm-hmm. this is how things should happen and if you want things to happen this way then we should have harmony here mm-hmm. it is not like we're projecting attitude or anything mm-hmm. so if acting in submission is supposed to show love then no mm-hmm. uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna go back to the bible and say is the man is always ahead yeah. unajua sure. and i'll still go back to the <laughs> same <laughs> bible <laughs> we'll still go back to the same bible mm. that when god made adam and eve he did not say that anyone should be superior over the other and no one should impose authority mm-hmm. over the other mm-hmm. okay uh, yeah. how come you missed that let me rebut on go back that to uh-huh. let me rebut on that uh you see the system mm-hmm. the system uh on gender like okay not gender on lady lady and uh, my gentleman side mm-hmm. was like they can as the feminist can say like it was corrupted at the end mm-hmm. like at the beginning you see when god created ev- uh, heaven and earth mm-hmm. he created ma- man and out of that man he created a woman mm-hmm and the man was given the responsibilities more than a, a woman like naming the animals mm-hmm. in the garden of eden really uh to add on that <laughs> you're lying. yeah that yeah you're fine. lying wow no, you lying. don't know that the man wasn't given responsibility we were both given responsibility okay but naming 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 the no okay oh, wow. okay let me go <laughs> to uh second timothy chapter 2 verse 9 uh-huh. it's talking of uh a lady uh-huh. okay a uh, wife submitting to a husband uh-huh. and that's all like the system for for the system to move uh, like smoothly mm. we should accept that mm-hmm. but you see those who don't accept you think the the breaking families uh-huh. you think mm. the what is happening in the country like the lady will like to to like compete with a man like okay you're doing this to me like i will rebut then you see like the man can get hungry like or the lady can kill the man so If you we accept been. this and move smoothly the system no. itself can i just no. pick yeah. something that you said i what you're saying is this the resort is a katana shoka ni juma dema to submit exactly imagine you're trying to justify what is illegal <laughs> okay. because so when they're not late. submitting wow. that okay. is why these exactly. guys are doing this and, and that's that's so illegal well, you, okay let me shoka. let me make that mm. again mm-hmm. you see you see what's happening mm-hmm. is that um men was like you know what a man can do mm-hmm. like the man can dare like even 
hell. Mm -hmm. So a lady can just come and compete with, like, you see, when mm -hmm. they, they some play out, mm -hmm. let's say the chick has played a man, mm -hmm. you see the man, like, this this not submitting, like, mm -hmm. the, the, the chick playing, the man will just come and, like, he can be upset and uh, provoked mm -hmm. and kill. Mm -hmm. And, like, when the lady mm. uh, do it, mm. we all agree that it's not that offensive. Uh, wow. Considering the fact that <laughs> polygamy is accepted almost everywhere in the world. Okay, there, yeah. there are so many yeah. things I have to say to that. First of all, let us just start with the message. Hi Val, my name is Mike. Napenda mamangu sana sana sana. Slay Queen can't come between us. Atakama ndo kubaki single forever. Ni baki huyo takataka ende. Okay, so we did get a couple of news clips ready for you. And I think there's one more video if I'm not too wrong. So I'm hoping my amazing directors up there will play it for me. But we do have to wind up. Not already to a conclusion. But uh, what are the party conclusions? Are Can I start? Where should I start? Can I start? Yeah, you're going to start with me. Huh? Look at him. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm going to give you one of the greatest combos ever in the Bible. Eh? Mm -hmm. And this is going to illustrate why. Like the, the, the bond between a, a, a man and, and their mother can never be broken. Uh -huh. Like when uh, in, the, in the household of Isaac, mm -hmm. When he wanted to bless his house, mm -hmm. the mother overheard mm -hmm. the conversation. And then he quickly went to Jacob and, he, and then she was like, hey, your dad wants to bless his wow. house. So, so go, quick, 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 get some blessing. Raka, go and get some goats, mm -hmm. ginger, and then I'm going to cook the tasty food that he likes. Uh -huh. And then the Jacob was like, okay, sasa na kijaribu kushika wa ngozi yangu wa sike. Na sina mwele. No, I'm going to cover that. Let those blessings, uh, let those curses mm -hmm. that are going to come if you're found out, mm. fall on me. Mm -hmm. And that's why I'm telling you, like, Mama's it's, boys it's always going to, if my spaghetti <laughs> is usually cooked with minced meat in, why kwa you want to cook spaghetti kando na minced meat kando? See, we just like, Since like, that what I should hear. Tumbo, well, in, my if you're used to... Give me your conclusion, sir. Make it brief, please. Okay, um, I'll try. Mm -hmm. uh, I want to conclude b uh, by saying mm -hmm. that, uh, we should all accept the system mm -hmm. in, uh, instead of fighting to outdo the system. Mm -hmm. uh, submitting will not cost, it's not costly. Mm -hmm. I don't mean like submitting, like kneeling down, but just submitting. When you submit, then all things will go through. Like the man will mm -hmm. also submit. Yeah, that's all. Thank you, Queen. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I, I totally agree, agree with him to some point. Mm -hmm. The fact that he said if you submit, he will submit to, that's okay. Mm -hmm. But the fact that you're trying to set a standard for relationships high, so mm -hmm. high that you're comparing me with your mother, mm -hmm. that's not working. So let's try and scrap that out and live in the 21st century. Yeah, because for the longest time, men have been telling us we're the ones with high expectations. Mm -hmm. Kumbe, the, the expectations are out of this they world. They carry so high well, in the moon. Okay, I love who women have been told to respect our husbands, and husbands have been told to love their wives is a difference. So we kazi yako ni kunipenda, ni kazi yangu ni kweshimu, which is hard already because I have a mouth. <laughs> yeah. Hi Val. Mimi ni wanya. I revenge my man loving his mom too much by loving my father in love too much. It worked miracles and he came back to love me. Eh eh. Okay. <laughs> To be continued at Y254 on Facebook, at Y254 channel on Twitter. Thank you so very much for taking this ride with us from 7 till 10 in the morning. Tomorrow is Money Making Tuesday. You really don't want to miss it. Thank you again. Have an amazing day and have an amazing week. I'll see you on Wednesday. Should we wave?